What is up guys, it's Saikuno here, and today we are playing as Riven. Oh, I think, I'm actually not sure if you guys said you liked colorblind mode or if you didn't like it, so I'm just going to leave it on because I am kind of getting used to it. Uh, so let's go ahead and head up here to the top and see who's jungling for us. We do have Olaf jungling, and I think he starts at blue. Where, where did he, where'd he go? I don't see him on the map. Welcome to what? Rift. No, where? Oh, oh, he's right next to me. Okay, I was, I was wondering, I was wondering where that Olaf was, because he just disappeared. So let's go ahead, and I think he's going to start at Wolves, maybe, but let's go ahead and see what they're, uh, they're saying here. What's going on, guys? Oh, that is wrong. That is wrong. I'm sorry. <laughs> but uh, let's, let's go ahead and check. All right, that's, that's good. That's good. Leash Blue. And does he want to start at Wolves and then Blue, or does he want to... I guess he's just starting at blue, so let's go ahead and head up to the top and check who we're up against. So they do have Jungle Deer, Support Alistair, Volibear, Akali, and Trindamir. So I'm not sure who's going... I think Akali's probably going in the middle because uh, she usually goes either top or middle, but I don't see her go middle very often. Let's go ahead and check this bush, and we are just fine. I think I'm going to be up against either Trindamir, maybe more likely Volibear, judging by these masteries. Or not masteries, uh, summoner spells. I think these aren't very good solo top spells, at least not as good as uh, Flash and Ignite. So I'm guessing I'm going to be up against Volibear, but we'll just see how it happens. We we do have Zareth and Urgot down here, and he has the new Battlecast Urgot skin, so that's pretty cool. Uh, they should have a really good range advantage down here. Because, as you can notice, the enemy team only has a melee champion, so that's going to be uh, that's gonna be our advantage, I think. Let's check this bush. And I am against Trindamir. That's definitely strange, but uh, it's just fine. I was going to start with cloth armor, but I decided not to because I forgot. Um, let's, let's go ahead and go for last hits, though. And not play too aggressive against this guy because I don't know how powerful he is yet. Oh, and I messed up my last hit. All right, this one's mine for sure. What?! Alright, this one's not mine. Oh, and he cut me once. Not doing very much damage. He's actually pretty low on HP. I have a bit more than him. And the stun! Oh, the stun did not go off! Oh, that is not good. He's definitely got a huge advantage over me now. I don't have much sustain, so I gotta play it careful, and he does have that heal. So I'm in quite a bit of trouble. Alright, let's go for a last hit, and we did get one. But we are behind. I think he has at least four last hits. I didn't see in that short, uh, that short little flash right there. Alright, let's sit back. We do have our shield, and we're going to use that in the trades. I got to stay back, and there's and the W, and one cut. Oh, but I don't have any minions. He's definitely got a pretty big advantage. I'm having a lot of trouble up here uh, because of a lot of small mistakes, and he's attacking me. Oh, I'm so low, and he's jumping out of there. Alright, this is not good. Why are the minions attacking me? I didn't even fight back against him, I don't think. Uh, let's just sit back here. Oh, he's trying to hurt me. Oh, this is... This is not looking good at all. I'm not sure how I'm going to beat this guy. I think my best option is maybe try and get him to dive me. Because if that doesn't happen, I don't know how I'm going to get him. Uh, let's just... Oh, no last hits. Alright, so I'm behind in last hits. I'm having a lot of trouble and he's still at full HP. So I'm not sure how I'm going to beat this guy. Uh, he has potions and... Oh, come on, dive me. Alright, he's not diving me. Let's pick up our Q. And kill these guys. Morgana picking up first blood, but Volibear almost getting first blood over there. And uh, this is not looking good for me. I'm not able to get too many last hits, actually. But, oh, what's he doing? All right, there's the shield. And cut him in the back once. Oh, the stun not going off. I was pretty sure I was in range, but it's just not happening. All right, let's pick up more stun and sit back here and see what we can do. We are behind by quite a few last hits, I think. All right, let's kill this. And how many last hits? Oh, he has more than double our last hits, so we're definitely pretty far behind. We gotta try and catch up. Oh, he took a shot from the tower, but he heals it back up instantly. He just has so much sustain. I don't think he's... Does he only have one potion? I'm not sure if it's glitched or something. Let's get in there, get one hit, and the W! Alright, he's taking a bunch of damage from the minions. I might be able to take him and ignite! And oh, the ignite was a little bit wasted, but we should be okay. Let's go ahead and go for last hits. And we did bring him down a little bit, but he does have quite a few potions. He has three potions left. All right, let's sit back here and go for last hits. It's not going to work well uh, for me because I don't have as much sustain as him. I need...
to get some kind of advantage. Otherwise, I'm going to be in a lot of trouble. All right, I do have the minion advantage. Oh, now I don't have the minion advantage. All right, let's sit back and uh, pick up more stun. And, oh, last hits are very dangerous right now. I think oh, I want to get in there, but it's it's a little bit too risky, actually. Uh, let's, let's just sit back here and go for these guys, because these are pretty safe last hits to uh, to get. And there's one. And, oh, he's coming for me. All right, I'm, I'm just fine, but... It's not it's not going well. I gotta play really defensively up here. Alright, let's get that. And the W Oh, it didn't work out. Looks like Olaf coming up to help me, because I'm definitely gonna need the help. Alright, let's sit back and is he gonna go in? Alright, dive in there and the stun going off in the Q and another Q and he used his clarity, not clarity, his uh what's what's that thing called that reduced well I mean I know what it does. I forgot what it's called is the is the problem that looks like oh cleanse. Alright, so it is it is called cleanse, but uh, he did use that and did get out of there. But it's just fine. He's not getting out next time. Did he use his ghost too? I wasn't watching. Looks like, oh! And he's not going to die from that, but it's definitely going to put me back in the game. I'm going to get some last hits here. Oh, maybe not get any last hits. Is he going to dive him? Oh, okay. That was, that was definitely diving him. Would have not been good. But I do have my ultimate. We might be able to actually dive him if I do use my ultimate. And my HP is looking pretty good. Uh, my last hits are not looking good, but Volibear getting another kill on Xerath. That's definitely not looking good for them down there. Uh, I thought they'd have a pretty easy time, but all right, let's let's use our ultimate. Dive in there and stun and Q and hit that guy one more time, but he's not taking all that much damage, actually. And another shot and another shot, and that guy's down. I cut this guy and head back to base. Uh, does he have boots? He does not have boots. He is out of potions. Oh, our ultimate ran out. Oh, I forgot to shoot my little thingy. He is fairly low on HP, I think. Oh, he's level 6. Alright, let's just get back to base and uh, pick up some more items because that is going to help us. Hopefully he doesn't check this bush. He is coming. He is coming. He's not coming. Alright, let's pick up two Dorns and head back out there. Alright, we should be able to beat him up pretty good because we have triple Dorns blade. New deer trying to come and gank me. It's a good thing I went back already. Alright, let's try and catch up though because now that he knows I'm not in the lane... He's going to push the lane and try and deal damage to my tower, which I do want to avoid. Uh, let's see how they're doing down here. Four and five and three and four. Oh, they are behind down here. So they're having a little bit of trouble. Morgana is doing okay in the middle. And Olaf is doing pretty good jungling. All right, I definitely have the advantage now. If Trindamir wants to do a battle with me, all right, he doesn't want to battle with me. And I can't blame him. Let's get in stun. And a Q going off. And another Q going off. And a cut. And another Q. And a cut. All right. He's taking a bunch of damage. He's trying to bait me under the tower. But it's not quite going to work. And the shield. And the stun going off. And the ignite going off. All right. Let's back off. And the ultimate not going to go off. It did go off. But I don't know if we're going to die. We are going to die. And he's down. And there we go, guys. You just got to play it safe for a while until you pick up that kill. It looks like Xerath still having trouble down there. Urgot is trying to do something, but can he get the kill? You gotta shoot something, Urgot! Oh, Urgot not able to pick up the kill. He might actually die, and he's turret diving him like a maniac, but Urgot able to make it there, make it out of there, actually, with a little bit of HP. He's going back to base now, but bottom lane definitely needs help. He's going for the kill, but Urgot can't do anything. His minions are taking it. Can he get out? Oh, he might pick up the kill, and the heal saving him. That is definitely... Not looking good down those for down there for those guys. Urgot not feeling too good, but it's just fine, guys. I'm doing okay up here. I don't think I've died yet. I am one and zero. I don't see Trindamir, so I'm gonna say top missing, and uh, hopefully it works out just fine. I don't want to push this tower. Let's head back to base and actually pick up our boots, cause. This guy just bought a bunch of stuff, and we're going to need every chance. We can stun him, and the Q, and the shield going off, and another Q, and another Q, and a cut in the back. All right, we got to get out of here if we can, and wait for it to stun going off. All right, let's just, and the shield, I don't want to use my flash unless I absolutely have to, and flash out. All right, let's see if he dies me. He did not dive me. I wanted to save my flash, but uh, I just had to use it. Oh, dear, killing. Oh, that's not good at all it is five to five so it looks like Morgana's doing pretty good and I'm doing all right but not really all that good so should we get mercury treads uh, how much CC do they have they have Trinmere kinda has a CC and this guy I don't think he has that much Udyr has a stun and I don't think well let's let's just get um 
Let's get this. We don't quite have enough for it yet, but we're, we're going to go ahead and head back to the lane. Oh, I am going to miss out on quite a bit of XP because of that. Trindamir is not going back to base. I thought he would go back to buy some items. He's going to do a bunch of damage to my tower. He's not going to bring it down, though, but that damage is something I definitely wanted to avoid. All right, let's try and catch up. My shield should be off cooldown by the time I get close enough for a battle. Looks like he's still sticking around. That's not a very smart idea. Use my ultimate, and the shield's going to be right there, and the stun going off. And the Q, not going off quite yet. 1Q, 2Q, 3Q, and a cut in the back. Alright, let's see if we can get this guy ultimate going off. And the shield, not going to get him. He used his ultimate. That was definitely a huge waste for him. This is going to be my chance to get my revenge on his turret. Because he did beat up my turret pretty badly. Let's go ahead and start taking these guys down. See what we can do. And another last hit for me. Alright, let's beat up this tower. And get revenge. So how much HP did we lose? We lost half of it. Udyr coming in and the shield going off. And the stun, but you're not quite going to get me. Trindamir coming in. What is he going to do? I can kill him in just an instant because he doesn't... Oh, that heal is berserk. Healing a quarter of his HP in just a second. What are they doing? This Udyr is just sitting there in the lane. I'm not quite sure if he thinks he can catch me or something. But let's, let's just get out of here because this is very dangerous for us. Uh, let's sit here to not miss out on too much XP, though. And Trindamir is... Alright, I'm, I'm waiting. I want to see if Trindamir is going to do something, because Udyr might still be lurking around. I don't know if... Alright, let's wait for it. He's going to come in this bush. And the stun going off! And 1Q! And 2Q! Oh, not able to get him. Triple Q! And one shot! udir has got to be coming, otherwise that Trindamir would not be trying to fight me. Alright, one cut! Stun! Cut! And I took a bunch of damage, but so did he. It's just fine, guys. Alright, looks like Udyr is actually not quite here yet. I'm not sure if he's just sitting in the bush, but uh, it's not gonna it's not gonna do him very much good if he's just standing in that bush. I am very close to the tower, so it's not gonna it's not gonna help him too much. I don't know where Trindamir went. Let's pick up more stun and keep on attacking here. Another Q and one shot right there. Alright, I don't know where Trindamir is. Looks like Udyr's coming somewhere. I'm not sure where they went. Udyr might be coming up here. I don't know, I mean, there's really, I'm so close to my tower, there's really, oh, with a stun going off, and a Q, and another Q, alright, it looks like he is running a Q, and Udyr is in a lot of trouble, he is preoccupied, Ignite going off, and the stun, oh, did not work, alright, can we get this guy, the shield, and one shot should get him, but he does have his ultimate, what is the cooldown on that, Udyr is, should be still preoccupied, I hope, it looks like this guy's trying to come help me, where is that Trindamir? Trindamir running back to base. Alright, let's just grab the tower, even if he gets back to base. That's just fine. Looks like Morgana picking up another kill on Akali. Let's go ahead and keep on attacking here. A Q going off. Oh, I'm taking a tower shot, but it's just fine. Let's go ahead and take this tower down if we can. It's going to take quite a bit of damage. Looks like Udir, not Udir, uh, Olaf coming up to help me out here. And let's start attacking this tower. Get a last hit. We don't want to miss out on those last hits. Let's go ahead and keep on attacking here. This tower could quite possibly go down. And both of those minions dropping from the W. Let's go ahead and finish off this tower. Morgana pushing her tower pretty well too. This tower is down. Let's go ahead and head to the bottom and try to help out Zareth because he isn't doing so well. He's 0 and 4 right now. So we got to help him out because once you get a couple deaths in your lane, uh, it becomes really, really difficult to come out of it. So let's go ahead and... Oh, we're not going for this. We're going for... Bloodthirster, so let's go ahead and head down here and uh, see what we can do. I think, alright, Olaf being a good teammate there, trying to make Zareth feel better. Uh, hopefully Olaf can defend top. I'm going to ping that and hopefully Olaf heads up there because I am heading to the bottom to try and help out. Uh, looks like Volibear is in the lane. I think his teammate just left the lane, so we should be... Oh my god, Volibear has Warmogs already. That is insane. Warmogs at 14 minutes in the game. That is, that is pretty crazy. How many, how many kills? Five and zero. Volibear. Oh my God. All right, looks like Zareth is here, but we're gonna have quite a bit of trouble. I don't know if just the two of us can take him. Udir is heading to the top. I'm gonna ping that. Hopefully they see that. Uh, what do we do? Looks like me and Zareth are down here. Zareth is not level six, but uh, let's sit back here. And I don't want to walk up too close. He can headbutt me into the tower. Alright, let's sit back here. See if we can get a stun. Oh, missing a stun. That is definitely not good. Can he land it? No, come on. Come on, help me. Alright, there's the ultimate going off. The stun going off. And the Q, one Q, two Qs, three Qs. And this guy's taking a bunch of damage, but so am I. Oh, and Volibear is six and zero. I couldn't even take him down. He's just 
too strong down there. I mean, he's got so much HP, and that's not to mention that his ability gives him more damage when he gets more HP. And with that, oh man, this is definitely not looking good. We gotta do something about that. Volibear Bear looks like Trindamir is gonna get ganked up here. Hopefully Morgana saves her Q. Oh, she did save her Q, but she still missed. Oh my god, Volibear Bear is 7 and 0. There's almost no way we're gonna take them down. Uh, let's just head down here and see what we can do. I think, oh, this is not good at all. Urgot is in quite a bit of trouble down here. They actually probably could dive him. Volibear is very strong down there. I do want to head down there and see if I can help, but I'm not sure what we can do right now. Uh, it might actually be better if I just head back to the top and uh, and I guess just farm it up and hopefully get strong enough, but I do want to kill this bottom lane. We can't just let them go uncontested down here. It's going to get worse and worse, so looks like Morgana is coming down to help us out. I don't think either of them bought wards because, uh, let's see, oh, Alistair may have bought wards. But let's go ahead and wait down here. Morgana is here. And with Morgana's help, we should be able to handle them. All right, let's sit back here. I don't see anybody in the bush. Oh, and none of them are here. They must have wards uh, because they did head back to their tower. All right, looks like Trinomir is getting that top tower. Oh, that is not good. All right, let's get Dragon because that is almost equivalent to a tower. Almost. Uh, let's go ahead and get Dragon here and start using our Q. I don't think he's going to push that far. Alistair and Akali come down here, but it's not quite going to work. Uh, Volibear, I don't think they're going to be able to do anything against all four of us, and they were not able to, but someone's got to head top to defend against that guy, because he might still be pushing. Uh, let's sit back here. Oh, there's four of them down here. I don't know what we can do against that, because that is a lot of them. All right, let's sit back in the tower and see if we can... Oh, they're coming. What are they doing? They're not coming. Uh, let's sit back by the tower, because our best chance is if they do decide to tower dive us. Uh, that's pretty much our only chance, now that I think about it, but... Other than that, we don't have many... I mean, that Volibear is just so strong, I don't know how we're going to kill him. I think, I mean, with that Warmog, he's got 2,400 HP. That is a ridiculously high amount of HP over us. So let's, uh, can't we harass him? Oh, that Q doing almost no damage. Udyr is coming down! We gotta get out of here! Alright, let's back off. Udyr's coming down! You gotta get away! Get away! No! Oh, no! Alright, let's, let's back off here! And try and get out of here, and the ultimate not going off. Let's try and jump out of the way. All right, are they going to dive us? They're not going to dive us. A stun going off? No stun. Oh, this is not good at all. He's throwing new deer back. And get this guy. Oh, use the E. Use the E and ignite this guy. All right, ultimate going off. And one Q, two Qs, and he's down, finally. This new deer trying to take me under the turret, but that's not a very smart idea. All right, let's get in there. And the stun going off Q, one shot. Alright, Morgana is coming in to help me out. Hopefully they can't get me. And they are able to stun me. I don't know where that stun came from. But Akali is coming down. Let's get out of here and pick up our uh, BF sword. We did finally bring down Volibear. But that was definitely not a good trade-off. I think they killed Xerath and Urgot. So that's definitely not good. They did tower dive us. So let's go ahead and pick this up. And go back to top lane for some last hits. Because we do need last hits. And, uh, I mean, in this situation where we are behind, it is 8 to 10, uh, we gotta go try and farm it up, hopefully. I'm 2 and 1, so I'm doing alright, but not very good. Uh, let's go ahead and head up to the top, though, and see if we can beat up this Trindamir. He does look fairly strong now. He has 171 damage and quite a bit of armor. Uh, he actually has more armor than me. A little bit less damage, but more armor is definitely something I gotta watch out for. I don't know where he went. He may be going for the blue buff, but uh, we I'm, I'm going to go ahead and just check for that after I uh, finish up this minion wave. So let's go ahead and head over here and see if Trindamir is over here. I saw him heading somewhere, but it looks like he didn't go for the blue buff, uh, which is just fine. All right, let's let's uh, let's try and kill this Akali, I guess. I mean, there's not too much else we can do. We don't want to push too far. Trinomir coming down, and he's not going to do anything. But it looks like they might be doing some river action here, or maybe, maybe not. All right, let's get around here. And we are going a pretty dangerous route, but we should be all right. It might pay off, actually. All right, let's wait in here for a good chance. And a ward going off. Can we finish it? No, we cannot finish it. 
Alright, let's try and get a kill. Morgana! Morgana's shooting her kill. It did hit Alistair, but I don't think we're going to pick up on the kill. And Zerat's dying again. Urgot in a lot of trouble. He's trying to do everything he can. He does have the armor bonus from his ultimate, but it's not quite enough. we got to get down there and help out Urgot if we can. He's doing as much as he can. He's doing a lot of damage. You might be able to take him down, actually. But, oh, you don't want to chase him in there. He can destroy you. He is healing very, very fast. Alright, we aren't going to be able to kill him, I don't think. Alright, that's definitely not a very smart move to dive him. He does have a lot of regen. He does have a lot of HP. We're not going to be able to take him in some kind of crazy charging battle. Alistair is there to heal him up. Alright, let's wait back here. Akali is coming down. Morgana trying to get a kill on Trinomir. It might not work. And he did get his Q off, but he used his W before his Q went off. Alright, let's get over here. See if we can do something. Alistair heading in. Let's try and get this guy. And Q stun. And he's not getting me. Alright, let's wait for it. And the ultimate going off. And Alistair, that's the Kelly, is almost down there, grouped up. Can I get some group stuns off? I'm trying to get group stuns off, but I'm not quite doing the damage I need to be doing. And another Q, and a third Q, and he's not quite down yet. We gotta get in there and finish him off, and he's stunned down. I'm taking a shot from tower. I might survive. I did survive, but is my team gonna be alright? Looks at me and Bob Patel getting out of there just barely. Very, very close. Let's try and run away for our lives, because we're in quite a bit of trouble. Trinomir's coming down. Alistair trying to do something, but it's not gonna work. Let's get under the tower. He's not gonna dive us. I do have my shield. Zareth is here to try and back me up on this. Hopefully they don't dive me. And Alistair is coming in, and it's not gonna work. I have my shield. Ignite and stun and oh, it's not quite good enough. Alistair is gonna go down and Zareth picking up his first kill, but he's in quite a bit of trouble. This guy's doing a lot of damage to him. Don't chase. Don't chase. All right, he's not chasing. That's definitely a good move because if he did chase, he'd be in quite a bit of trouble. All right, what do we buy next on this guy? I don't really... I think we go for Phage, I think. All right, it looks like that was definitely pretty good. We did close the gap a little bit. It is 12 to 13 now, so we were able to kill that Volibear. Bear. He didn't quite buy enough armor, and that was his biggest problem. So we were able to do quite a bit of damage to him. Uh, he is picking up some armor, though. He did get a chain vest, and we can get our long sword. So, <sighs> sorry, guys. All right, let's keep on going. And it looks like Top Tower is pushing pretty easily. Bottom is in quite a bit of trouble. They gotta watch out. Udyr is coming and he's not really doing anything. I don't know what he's doing. But let's go ahead and head back to the middle. Because middle might actually be in quite a bit of trouble. I think Morgana is going to be in, tr in danger of a gank from Udyr. I did see him heading up here. I'm not sure if they're, if he's doing anything major. But let's go ahead and not explore the river by ourselves. I don't see Udyr. He might just be jungling. Uh, fairly safely. Let's shield in there to be careful. Alistair is right there. I'm not sure what he's doing. I wasn't paying attention to the dragon timer. Is it coming up soon? I don't really I don't really know, but our team is in position. It looks like they did drop a ward, but that's not going to do very much. Udyr is heading around. Let's count to a couple seconds. Alright, let's try and catch up on them. Volibear is down there by himself. Can we get them? Alright, ultimate going off. And one Q, two kills, and the stun going off. And this guy is down. Trindamir heading up from the back. Let's head back up, guys. All right, Morgana's following up on me. Trindamir should be coming in any second now. All right, he's not coming. I think he knows that we are waiting here. My ultimate is off cooldown. This is not good. All right, let's get out of here, guys. we got to regroup with the team, and hopefully that will work out well for us. All right, we want to get this bottom tower. The other lanes seem to be doing just fine. Looks like Dragon was about to come up, so let's go ahead and keep track of the time this time. And uh, see see how it goes. So let's go ahead and use our W and finish this guy off. So that's 23:25 about. So I'm gonna say something. I do have my timestamps on. So A E F means dragon. Uh, so in six minutes, I think. So 29:30, dragon should be up. All right, let's get down here and try and help out Urgot. Alistair trying to do something. I don't know what he's doing. He might be coming around here. I might be able to get a kill if he does circle around. But he's not actually circling around. So let's sit here. And wait for a good chance. Top Tower pushing pretty well. They gotta go defense that. Defend that. That was terrible grammar. Alright, let's wait up here. Alistair, I don't know where Alistair is. He might be in that bush. Udir is also missing. Mid lane is in prime position for a gank. It's very dangerous. But no, oh, this is not looking good. I am missing out on quite a bit of XP. Alistair is right there. I know they can't take me. Let's get in there. Get a Q off. Another Q off. And he's getting the stun off. And no ignite quite yet. Alright, Alistair is going to go down from the Ignite. No ultimate going off. And this Volibear trying to do something. Let's go ahead and attack this guy and not dive him. Oh no, Urgot taking a bunch of damage. Another shot, but not quite enough damage. 
And another Q. All right, we are going to be able to get out of here. I don't know where Udir is. We're going to have to play it safe. We do have a lot of minions, but it's definitely very dangerous to be pushing right now. Uh, Volibear, Bear, I don't know if he has his, his regen thing, so let's go ahead and check. It doesn't show me his debuff, and I'm not sure why it would actually, but Volibear. Bear... Is gonna take a lot of damage on the W going off at a Q. I right, don't let him get me. All right, me and Ergot should be able to finish him. He did use his bite on me, but not much damage. He does have his regen, so we got to back off. He did waste his regen, so that's definitely good for us. But uh, it's not looking too good. He's very tanky. We're not gonna be able to dive him. Udir might be coming down at any second. If we see Volibear charging, we're just gonna have to run for it. We don't have any wards, so that's definitely gonna make it difficult. Let's keep on attacking here, and another shot right there. Alright, it looks like Udir, uh, not Udir, Volibear is right there. He has quite a bit of HP, actually. We won't be able to die him. Urgot is going back to base. I'm going to go back to base, too, to pick up my Phage, because that is going to help me quite a bit in chasing people down. So it looks like, I think Volibear might actually be afraid to push out by himself. So that will work out. We're not going to miss out, or at least he's not going to close the gap too much. Or, I guess, we're not going to... He's, he's not going to get that many last hits, because he doesn't know that we're not there. Their entire team is missing. I don't know where they went. Um, let's let's just head over to the top because that is going to be a lane to push right now. Let's head over to the top and get some uh, get some more lasted. It right, looks like Trinomir's right here, but I should be able to take him in a one-on-one -on -one battle without even using my ultimate, I think. Uh, oh, he is level 16! Trindamir is level 16 because he has been farming quite a bit. This guy's coming in and my ultimate going off. All right, one Q, two Q is not quite good enough. All right, let's back off using the ultimate to clear the minion wave. And that was probably a waste, but it's just fine. This guy's not going to do very much. Udir coming in. Oh, Zareth is in quite a bit of trouble. Zareth, oh, no. All right, let's start attacking this guy. One Q, two kills, three Q. Stun going off. Jump out of the way. He's not going to tower dive me. I might need some help, but Zareth is having quite a bit of trouble down here. All right, or not down here, but he's having quite a bit of trouble. All right, let's try and clear the minion wave. I don't know where they went, but I doubt Udir and Trindamir are still lurking around. They are still lurking around, and what is this guy doing? All right, let's jump in. Stun, one cut, and back off. I didn't get the cut off. One Q, and he's taking a bunch of shots from the tower. That is definitely not good. And third Q going off. They're not quite going to get me that shield. And the stun going off. One cut on this guy. They're taking a bunch of damage. And they're taking a lot of damage from that tower. That was not very smart for them. Morgana is coming in to try and help me out. But my guess is they're already backing off. So let's go ahead and try and take out these minions before they get too close to the tower. Because I do want my minion wave to be pushing. Alright, these guys should be down. It looks like they are fed. Yeah, they, they've been fed. But let's go ahead and keep on attacking here. And uh, what do we get next? Trindamir is going to take this tower down. Oh, there's nobody to defend it. Akali and Trindamir are both there. There's not too much we can do. Uh, let's go ahead and head down here and get to the middle if we can. And I think I, we're not going to get any kills, but it looks like there is a battle going on down here. He's going to need a lot of help. I don't think he's going to survive. Zareth doing as much damage as he can, but it's just not enough damage. Trindamir coming in, and the stun. Oh, my dash. I messed up my dash. That is definitely not good. Let's get around here. Olaf is low on HP. They might try and dive him, but it looks like they're not going to try and dive him. They are quite low on themselves, so I don't know if... Oh, this is not good, Zareth. You got to stay back. All right, let's sit back by this tower. Morgana's got to come help us. Morgana is not coming to help us, but I think we might actually be able to take this on our own. Uh, let's check this bush, and we are just fine. And cut this guy, and Zareth doing a bunch of damage there. And a Q to finish this off, or an auto attack to finish this guy, actually. Alright, let's sit back. Looks like that's not quite going to work. Uh, they are very tank, or at least Volibear. Oh, Volibear picking up Thorn Mail. That is definitely not good to see for me. Uh, who is our main ability power damage deal? We have two ability powers, so it's going to be... I think it's going to be up to Morgana and uh and Zareth to take out that Vola bear otherwise we're not gonna have much of a chance Morgana being chased down let's go try and help her if we can and he uses his, his cleanse to clean up that but how is he gonna get out of this the tower is down he's flashing but Vola bear chasing him down he actually got out just fine but it is three against two and that Trindamir is very very powerful let's go ahead and use our Q to farm these guys looks like the tower is down so that's definitely good for us I don't think we have enough for Frozen Mallet. They did ward right here. This is not looking so good. And Olaf charging in. I don't know if that's a very good idea. Uh, it's almost 29. Dragon is up. 
Alright, let's go ahead and get Dragon, because that is going to be good. They don't have Trindamir, so if they do engage us, it will be a 5 against 4 battle. And that's not going to work out for them. I don't know if they even have wards here, because it doesn't look like they're heading for it. But uh, we have gotten Dragon, I think, 3 times. So that's definitely going to be our advantage. They're shooting his little shot a little bit too late. I don't have enough for Frozen Mallet yet, I don't think. Alright, I don't have enough yet. So let's go ahead and push this tower. Looks like a Cali won't make it in time. Trindamir has a chance to make it in time, but I don't know if he's actually going to make it. Let's go ahead and queue these guys and finish off this turret. Trindamir pushing, but that just means we can push one more because Trindamir is not there. Volibear trying to do something. It's not going to work. Ignite going off on Volibear and going in with the shield and the kill. Volibear taking a bunch of damage and Volibear is down and I'm on a killing spree, but I have a shield to tank the tower shots. I'm taking a lot of damage. The ultimate going off to finish off the minion wave. All right, let's get out of here. Try and take these guys down. Are they going to go for me? I don't know, but let's go ahead and take this down. Looks like Trinamira is heading back to base to finish off this Alistair if we can and not able to finish him. We got to play it safe. Let's try and finish this. And uh, he's not actually going for me. He's going for Morgana and the sun going off. All right, we got to get this inhibitor even if we lose this team fight. As long as we get the inhibitor, it's worth it. All right, let's clear out, guys. Let's clear out. All right, looks like me and True Flights are both on the same page here, both backing out after the inhibitor's down, because we got to remember our goals, guys. We can't just go for the kills every single time, because kills don't win games. They, they help you win games, but it's more important to remember to push the towers and get out alive. So let's go ahead and get back to base, pick up our frozen mallet, and next on the list is going to be Atma's Impaler. I think they do have quite a bit of physical damage, so I think I might have enough leftover money to pick up a chainmail vest. I think that's what it's called, but I'm not 100% sure. Uh, let's go ahead and check where is it. Oh, it's just a chain vest, not a chain mail vest. Uh, but we do have frozen mallets, so let's go ahead and head over here. They aren't focusing me all that much, which is... Uh, I, I usually... I'd like to go for Guardian's Angel after this, but they aren't focusing me all that much, so I'm just gonna go ahead and for... I'm gonna go ahead and go for Atmas and frozen mallet before I get my Guardian Angel. And then uh, let's let's go ahead and get... Oh, they're going for the blue buff, perhaps, but I'm not 100% sure. Uh, let's sit back here. Trindamir has been farming quite a bit up there, uh, but Morgana does have about equal CS, so it is evening it out all right. But it looks like there's a huge team fight that's going to happen. Let's tell him to back off. Morgana, I'm going to call Morgana over. Hopefully he comes to pick this up. And oh, they got it. Morgana's got to come over here before it's too late. The W going off. This guy's very low on HP. Morgana is not coming over. I don't think, oh, Morgana's not coming over. All right, he is coming over. Now I know how it feels when I was playing Morgana when your, uh, when your carry does not come over for the blue buffs. So I, I'm trying to read the chat more, guys. All right, he's not getting it. Oh, it did regenerate. He didn't do quite enough damage. Oh, this is not good. Stun, Q, I'm going to try and help him finish it. That's definitely not good. Oh, this is, this is just terrible, and he missed his Q again. All right, he should be able to pick it up now. But that was definitely a lot, a lot of wasted time. Alright, let's go ahead and just start attacking these guys. Q, one shot there, another Q, and he's down. Alright, I don't know if it's a very good idea to engage right now. We don't have the entire team with us. They might have their team. They do have the Baron buff. Oh, that is not good. We didn't have wards on Baron. Alright, we gotta defend the tower. They do have Baron. So let's just sit back by the tower. I'm gonna ping that, and hopefully they sit back, and we defend this tower pretty well. I think there's three of them there, but they could be in the bushes waiting. Unless I see them in the other lanes, I don't want to engage because it is a little bit too risky. All right, these guys are poking pretty well. Let's stay in a little closer position because if they do initiate, Trindamir is not there. Let's go for it. Trindamir is not there. So let's go ahead and try and get these guys ultimate. Not quite yet. The stun going off. No stun. Oh, this is not good. We weren't able to get any stuns off on them. All right, let's, uh, let's go for the bottom turret. I think we might be able to get it. We are playing offensive, even though they have Baron buff. That's definitely very, very risky, but I think it might pay off. We do have a pretty good minion advantage, so I think it might actually work out for us. All right, looks like the blue buff is right there, ready to be taken. Who needs it? I guess give it a... I mean, anybody. I guess Zareth, maybe? Oh, and Olaf taking the blue buff. But we should be able to get this tower. I think we have tons of minions. Akali dropping it. Oh, Olaf in a lot of trouble. But let's take this tower down first. All right, this tower is taking a bunch of damage. Will we get them? Oh, this is not good at all. All right, let's get some stuns off. And oh, I'm in quite a bit of trouble getting the ultimate off. Where's the rest of the team? Oh, they're not there. Ultimate going off on this guy. Stun, we're doing a bunch of damage, but not quite enough. We're not focusing well enough. Oh dear, is down there all very, very low. Alistair's almost out flashing over. Alistair is down. All right, let's get a stun. 
try and get out of here if we can. Oh, this is not good at all. He does have endless rage. All right, let's just run for it. We might actually be able to take them. Shield going up and Q. We got to focus that Akali if we can. All right, we got to get out of here, actually. All right, wait for the shield. And the shield going off. Oh, and even with the shield, not quite enough to tank it. This is definitely not good. Uh, I think the problem was some of them didn't want to engage. I think that was the biggest problem. I think some of us uh, didn't want to engage, so we weren't in position. But the minute that Zareth got, yeah, I mean, he's got the right idea. So I'm going to say yeah th on that too, because right when Zareth gets caught, we either have to all go in and try and take him down, or Zareth is going to die and we're going to lose anyway. So it's either go in and have a chance to win, or go in and just lose. So Or not go in and just lose. So we didn't have too many options there, to be honest. Looks like Top Tower might actually go down. I don't have enough money for Amma's Impaler yet, because I wasn't able to to pick up any kills there, so it's not looking good. Top Tower, not going down. Udyr made it in time to defend it. Uh, they weren't actually able... Oh, we didn't check the Baron timer, uh, but we, we weren't actually able to... I mean, we did get one turret, so that's good. But uh, it's not looking so good for us. Alright, Dragon is up. Let's go ahead and go for that. I think the Baron buff did run out on them. Alright, the Baron buff did run out on them. I don't know how long the Baron buff lasts, actually. Otherwise, I could figure out the time. Uh, let's go ahead and get down here and see what we can do. I think, where is, uh, is our whole team here? I feel like we're missing somebody. I think, oh, Zareth is dead, actually. I thought he was alive a minute ago, but, all right, let's, um, what can we do right now? Uh, I think, I mean, we can't push. It's not very safe. Uh, we can go check Baron, then we can see when it respawns. So let's go ahead and head over to Baron and see what we can do. I don't think they're there because Udyr is not standing there. So let's just walk in here, and oh, Baron is still gone? Oh, that's exactly what I expected, actually. Uh, let's, let's go ahead and jungle, though, because there's not much else we can do. Someone has the push, and it shouldn't be us, I don't think. We are, quote-unquote, losing, because we are down in kills, but I don't feel like we're really losing all that much. Uh, that last team fight, we just had a lot of bad... Uh, we just had miscommunication, I guess, because some of us, I think a, 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 couple, a couple of us were backing off, and the other ones were not bagging off. I don't know why he has oracles. I guess he's trying to take our wards down, but... Alright, looks like they are split up. We might be able to get a kill here. Alright, let's let's get in there and see if we can get a Q off. A Q off? Alright, I'm going in for the kill. A Q going off. And this guy's not getting... Oh, that is not good. Alright, looks like that didn't work out too well. I was trying to catch him, but just not fast enough. I was thinking about using my ultimate, but it's a good thing that I did not actually... Alright, let's, um, I think, oh, Alistair's right there! Oh, this is not good, their entire team's there! Alright, the Q going off, ultimate going off, stun's going off on all of them! Alright, let's go ahead and look for someone to ignite! No, this is not good at all! And Q going off on a bunch of them! Alright, shield going off, stun going off, ultimate, ignite going off on that guy! Alright, let's try and get out of here! They're all very, very low on HP! Alright, looks like we might win this team fight! Another kill! Oh, a shield! Going off. Thank you, Morgana, for the shield. Another shield and an ace. No way. There we go, guys. That's how we do it. All right, we did lose. I think we lost Zareth, but it's okay. Zareth, your sacrifice will not be in vain. We might be able to finish them. I think we got this. All right, let's get in there and try and finish them off. Urgot does have Guardian's Angel. We might be able to take at least one tower. All right, we're going to get the inhibitor and maybe one tower. I think we might be able to finish this if the minions get here in time. All right, let's go ahead. And go for this. I'm going to tank the first couple shots with my shield. One and two. And get out of here before I die. All right, let's get in there. I'm playing a very risky game. We only have a couple seconds left to use my ultimate to try and destroy these guys. And it looks like it might actually be over. All right, let's finish off this Nexus before we take too much damage. I think we got this. Let's Q and Q one more time. Alistair coming in. Akali is also coming in. All right, let's back off. We're just fine. And this is the traditional dance after victory. And that was definitely a pretty good game, guys. Zareth had a hard time, but it looks like when it came down to it, he pulled through. So good job, guys. I'll see you guys next time.